And then I was against George W. Bush when he ran. I thought that was a huge mistake. I was only on the George Bush bandwagon. You don't remember that, Stu? Don't you remember me giving that deal when they nominated him and I said, you're dead, yeah, you're early over. Early on, you were, not, you were not a fan. Right. And I will I say was, you came around to him uh, in, well, I, for, on many things at, uh, during his term and, and yeah, as no, I hang closer, on just a second. Yeah. Could I? May I? You just I, asked I was, me a question. Yeah, I know. I, when I got onto the GOP, <laughs> well, because you're just, you're constantly questioning. I, I'm answering the question that you. I'm just Whatever. trying to clarify. You he, he really long, wanted to answer, though. You yeah, no, really he wanted me to just. No, 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 because, no but longtime listeners would remember. Clearly yeah, I was not right. Right, I was not for George W. Bush. I became a George W. Bush supporter because of the 2000 election, and I'm like, he's the damn president. Leave it alone, Jeffy. You were there. Leave mm-hmm. it alone. I was not for. I remember that show I did, Jeffy, where I said the GOP is dead. You've just elected Al Gore. Do you remember that? Yes. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it was like, th- this is a huge mistake. This guy's a nightmare. Um, and so uh, uh, the um, uh, the 2000 election happened, and I, I became a rabid support George W. Bush because Al Gore is trying to steal it. And then, as soon as 9-11 happened, I thought the guy turned into a, I thought he was great. I thought he was really, really great. And I bought into that for a long time. And so I overlooked things and I disengaged because there was always a flag waving someplace and the fireworks were going like. You're demeaning your opinion here, though. I mean, it was based on the fact that he was doing a really good job on the war on terror. It was a serious threat. But I did not look into things like the Patriot Act because. I just thought, I mean, you know me, I was saying before in 2000, I was arguing, I think, with you about things like facial recognition on street corners oh, yeah. and oh, things yeah. like that. So I was That's against a- it. And then all of a sudden I was like, da, 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 <laughs> I, I, I don't know why I'm arguing in your favor here, but you were very clear about the idea that this is something that needs to be short term. It has to have sunsets. You've yeah. argued strongly for that. Da, 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 <laughs> that right, shouldn't whatever. have happened at all. Uh, no, it should, right, shouldn't have happened at all. I was wrong on that. Uh, you're right. That I did say sunsets and it's got to be short term and everything else. But I still, I believed that people in Washington were decent human beings. <laughs> da, 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 da. <laughs> not true. Not true. <laughs> so I'm just not going to give them any benefit of the doubt anymore. No more power. No more compromise. Let's see a principle. 